it's one thing to have a great idea. It's an, quite another to execute it well. When you look back now, and I know you're still early phase in Slate, but you've got clients, you've got teams you're working with, you've got leagues that are working with your product because it's good, right? It works for them. As you look back now, what were the key moments in taking Slate from this good idea that you and Michael Horton sit around at a bar writing down on a napkin or whatever to an actual formalized product that you can go to a team, you can go to a league and say, this is it. This is why you want it and have them say, yeah, we do. We see it. Yeah. I mean, that was one of the big kind of benefits that at least I had stepping into this. And really it, it, it comes down to my three co-founders, Michael, um, Yuri and Will, who were them three were working on a different product for the year before a year and change before slate. Um, So they had built a mobile app and it was um, a B2C SMS texting app where you can kind of text in different fonts. Um, So they, they were working on something already and basically kind of the, the impetus of slate like came out of a conversation they had with a brand and a conversation that Michael and I then had afterwards. And Michael took that back, you know, all that information, that he had learned from the brand. And then when we had talked and said, wow, this is something that could be really impactful, especially in sports, basically took it back to to his team there and they spun up a version of it really quickly. Um, Cause they already were, like I said, you know, building kind of a product and a lot of the infrastructure or some of the infrastructure from that product was used to create Slate. Um, so, you know, Yuri, who's our CTO and, and he was the developer, he he's basically a genius and just built it really <laughs> That always quickly. helps, right? Um, yeah, so all of a sudden, <laughs> and like I mentioned, like I just kind of was spitballing the idea with Michael and it felt like, you know, a few weeks, maybe it was a month or so later, you know, he was sending me a prototype of the app. I was like, what? Like, this yeah. is crazy, you know? So yeah. all of a sudden, you know, we had something to then go um, knock on doors with and show teams and get um, feedback from and kind of it, it went from there but yeah really the kind of infrastructure that those three guys laid at, laid and then you know being able to take an idea basically pivot what they were doing before to to this which was totally different b2b like totally different type of business um, really allowed us to get a product like out there quickly and then just build on it from there 